Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today we're going to have a weekly meal and in total I'm going to have around 3,000 calories and I hope you do guys enjoy this video. All being said, I'm now 18 weeks out to my first ever competition in Bodybuilding. I am actually excited for it. The nerves have calmed down because I have gone leaner and I'm so far ahead of my expectations of where I should be. I'm like, I got this in the bag though. I'm just really enjoying the process at the moment. Yes, it has been hard, a little bit tired mentally, and I have been a little bit tired uh, because of the low energy and all, but at the same time, I wouldn't change it because I'm progression really well. I'm really happy with it. Um, but that's why I'm having a refeed meal so that my energy levels go back up for a little bit and I can feel a lot more happier about myself and then just continue actually killing the gym and cardio and just enjoying the process that I'm on and in some ways having this refeed meal um, for myself I just, just quite a nice way to just, just relax slightly just because it allows me to just enjoy something, something that I've not had in a while so uh, stick around see what I have Let's get on with things. First of all, we have the most important meal of the day, breakfast. More or less, I will always more prep my food just because it's a lot easier and quicker and more efficient with my time. Uh, the only downside of it is it's not warm, but I always need to microwave it, which is a bit of a pain. While that is cooking away, I do have my turkey bacon as in the air fryer. So now all of that's done, now to put on my toppings. I got uh sauce, seasoning, salt and pepper, and basil for the eggs. Oh that was just lovely. It was such a nice meal. I mean for myself, this is what a healthy English breakfast can be and it's so nice. Uh, yes, it's a little bit dry with turkey bacon, but if you do it just right and eat it straight away, you won't even tell it's not it's not bacon, not pork. Uh, but yeah, apart from that, really good. Uh, really enjoyed it, like always. So supplement wise, I have a multivitamin, omega 3 and vitamin D. Because my diet, I can be in deficient in some uh, micronutrients. So the uh, multivitamins is just there just in case I don't have enough micronutrients. The omega-3 is there because I don't have any fish in my diet. And the vitamin D is there because of the English cold and the winter, which isn't great for your health. I have it so that I feel a lot more energized, a lot more happier, especially in the winter months. And I really would recommend having vitamin D all that factor. Also from last week I was at 67.9 kg and then this week the lowest that had been had been 66.9 kg which is a whole nearly 2 kg difference and I'm really really happy with that progress. And, and all being said the 66.9 kg is actually the lowest weight I've ever been uh, ever uh, which is really quite cool to go down into and from now on uh, hopefully after this refeed I know I'll be going down lower which will be good for my physique to look in the best as it can. The one thing that I have learned is that you now I'm at a lean stage is the weight doesn't really matter that much is how I appear. So it could be that I look really good at say 65, 64 kg whilst uh, in some ways I could be a lot more leaner at say 63 but then I don't have but then I don't have enough mass on my size. So it's all about the way that I look and to see whether or not the seat looks good. Uh, so that's where I'm going to change my mindset to rather than fixating on over the weight on the scale. I've just got into work and now I'm all changed for the cardio that I'm going to get done. So it's going to be 30 minutes on the same master at level 12. So wish me luck. Let's do this. Yeah. 
avocado is all done. I'm hot and sweaty. Legs feel like jelly, but happy it got done. Now time to have my lunch before I start work. You can see this way, I'm enjoying off my eyelashes, which is a bit weird and cool at the same time. But this is what hard work looks like. I'm so happy that I've done it. For lunch, I have a uh, bolognese with cheese, and in the bottom is potato. Basically, it's a shivered pie, but it's more deconstructed than anything else. Because personally, I don't like shivered pie, but this I do like. So, let's enjoy it. Absolutely love that meal. It was so nice. Um, for me, it's just because it's, it's beef, a little bit different in the day, and just a good classic meal to have. But yeah, now time to go and shift. Let's do this. I just come in here just to have some lunch. And for myself, what I have been up to so far on shift, just done a little bit of cleaning, mainly done some gym resets, making sure the gym is nice and tidy, and having out members, which has been always quite nice. But I'm looking forward to finish work, because I'm quite tired. But apart from that, it's been a good shift. So what do I have for my second lunch? What I have is some uh, veg, 200 grams, and then I have 150 grams of turkey steak which is absolutely delicious with some uh, barbecue sauce again as i've now just finished work and i thought i'm going out for my refeed meal i thought i was just up so i'm just quickly to show you my outfit for tonight now it's time to go to, go to the meal i'm so looking forward to it and i want you guys to guess before I go there, can you guys guess where I'm going to? It's going to be a, a takeaway place and it has three or four main things on the menu and they're really known for it and it's really decent uh, food and really enjoyable and it's served by five people. If you can guess the hint, then comment down below uh, and let's see people's answers. But at the same time, it's such good food. Let's go. If you can guess five guys, then you're correct. I can't wait to try the food here because I've had it in the past and it's just chef kiss. So it's going to be such a good meal to have. I've been looking for it since all day, since Friday even. When I got told, told I'd have a, a refeed, and I'm so happy for it. One thing that I have done is I have pre ordered my food just because one, saving time, and also two, it does help with adherence. So I ever can, I was trying to reduce the fact that I could go off plan and this is where I ordered last night when I was nice and full so then I can d just go today, pick up my order and enjoy it rather than coming into the store, yes I'm hungry so then I'm thinking ok I'm going to go off plan a little bit and order a bigger size meal which I could have done and doing this allows me to just relax more knowing what I've ordered is knowing what I'm gonna get and be happy with it rather than changing my mind and going for something else. And that is just little things that can really help you with progress and with adherence. Here's a few guys, so what do I get? That is the question. I got small fries and a bacon cheeseburger with two patties and mushrooms with lettuce, grilled onions uh, and ketchup, which I'm so looking forward to having. Now just look at this, always chips and it is a small size but obviously with our guys we love to look after the customers so we uh, always get more chips than you always are for in the bag which I just love. So let's enjoy it. Oh. 
almond days. That is so good. So tasty. So, oh, so happy with it. Let's go. Burger, now two minutes. Oh, so happy with it. So good. So tasty. So crispy as well. Um, I also I noticed with the burger, uh, with the um, buns, it was actually uh, two tops, which is quite interesting and a bit unique, but really nice. So let's get, let's get on with the chips. With everything with Fire Guys, all the chips are all made in house, and you can tell it's just so nice, so fresh, so enjoyable. The chips, like always, is so nice, so tasty. A puffy inside, but also crunchy. It's just perfect. So happy with it. <laughs> One burger and chips. Absolutely, absolutely demolished and I'm so happy for it and I feel quite good actually right now. Yes, I need, need to, I need to have some water but apart from that, really good, really happy with the meal. And yeah, this is, this is going to be something I'm going to look back on when I'm in prep and in, in that hard cut and struggling and I'm going to have a video and enjoy when I had this meal. And hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. I've got a little bit more food to eat for this evening. But I'm happy, so happy with it. My final meal for today, we have 80 grams of chicken, 250 grams of yogurt, and 10 grams of chocolate, dark chocolate, at 80%. Totally forgot, I need to do an outro. So, I am really tired, as I had had a very long entire day, but I feel really full, really happy with my adherence with the plan, and the progress that I've made. I'm really looking forward to what I can achieve in the next 18, 17 weeks left. Yeah, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.